hey guys what's up yo how are you guys doing okay guys so you're welcome back to my channel and you're welcome back to today's video now in today's video I'm gonna be showing you what a dermatologist will not tell you now I am one but of course sometimes we actually do not show our clients some other things because you know it is not necessary but yeah I'm, I'm showing you for free I'm, sh I'm, I'm giving you this for free okay so this is an anti-aging remedy that when you apply it onto your face or onto your skin it helps to leave your skin glowing it helps to make your skin look very smooth and it also vast aging okay it helps to remove a little bit of those fine lines and wrinkles here and there and it keep your skin very very beautiful okay guys so let me take you right into this video okay and do not forget to give me a thumbs up subscribe to my channel and share this video and let us go all right so we're gonna be needing um aloe vera fresh aloe vera is required for this remedy guys okay because aloe vera contains numerous benefits that helps to make your skin look younger it helps to remove wrinkles and as well as fine lines and it also helps to repair your skin therefore keeping it really really young all right guys so what we're gonna do now is that we're gonna prepare this aloe vera by cutting off the edges okay this is actually the simplest way in which I know how to just prepare aloe vera and extract the juice. Yeah. Now after that is done, I like to use a crater to just create the gel from the inside, just like this, so that I won't have to experience any lumps at all. There won't be any lumps or whatsoever. So. I have to create this and then it's not going to be too slimy when I create it so you can actually try this method also to extract your aloe vera gel now after that is done this is how it is you can see it's not too slimy but when other ingredients is mixed with it it's going to be looking really better now the next ingredient we're going to be making use of is going to be onion. Now onion is a great remedy that helps to calm the skin. It helps to remove um, pimples and it also helps to reduce the size of pores on the skin. Therefore making your skin look really really smooth. So we're going to be preparing the onion. Now after that is done, we're also going to be creating it. Okay guys, so for this onion, you can actually blend it, okay, if you don't want to create it. But I find creating it really, really simple and really fast, yeah? That's why I want to create mine. And using red onion is perfect guys because it's actually more stronger than the white onion so you can reach out for a red onion so after that's done we will have to be extracting the juice of this onion so just pour it into the strainer and then press it you can see uh, onion has an, a, lot, a lot of juice though so you don't have to put any more water to get the juice out so after that is done this is the onion juice 
yeah and we're going to be putting in about two tablespoons into this aloe vera juice and that's actually two tablespoons a good measurement So you have to then stir the mix together and this is how it's going to be like. Now the next ingredient is going to be honey. Now honey is a great moisturizing agent for the skin. It helps to keep the skin moisturized. It also helps to lock in moisture onto the skin. It makes the skin look really, really soft and it also helps in repairing a damaged skin. So, one tablespoon of honey into this mix. Alright, so you're going to give it a little stir also. And the next thing we're going to be needing is yogurt. Now yogurt contains a natural lactic acid which helps to repair the skin tissue. It, it helps to remove or revise, revive the signs of aging like um, wrinkles and fine lines. It helps also to tighten up the skin by closing up a larger open pores and it helps to reduce the excessiveness of oil production. We're going to be adding that also into this mix. And here we're going to be taking two tablespoons of organic yogurt. Yeah, that's okay. And then you give it a little stir up. It's not going to mix very well, but of course, just a little stir. Okay. And this is how it looks like. Okay. Now the last ingredients we're going to be needing for this ingredients is going to be milk. Now milk works exactly like yogurt, but of course milk contains protein that the skin needs. The skin needs elasticity to, you know, keep your face or your body or your skin looking really young and healthy. So all of those ingredients are loaded in milk which helps to make you look younger, brighter, and fresh. So we're going to be needing just two tablespoons of this milk into this mix. Okay. Now after we mix all of this ingredient together, we'll have to be getting... So I have a matter mixer in which I'm going to be using to mix this all up. So we're just going to turn in all of this so that we we'll have a perfect mix of everything. And this is perfect guys. It's properly mixed and this is how it looks like. Okay, now if you have the time, you can actually apply this every day for the space of two weeks. And you're going to see a whole lot of difference on your skin. Otherwise, you can apply it two times in a week or three times in a week. And your skin is going to be refreshed, guys. Your skin is going to be looking really young. Okay guys, so this is it and number one, it smells good, yeah, okay, and you can actually use it every day if you want, just like I said before, okay, so what you do is to grab a brush and then you dip this in and then you apply it on you, to your skin. Now before you apply this guys, you would have to refrigerate it, okay? 
and then you apply this generously everywhere onto your skin with your eyes closed because if you're using red onion it's actually going to be you know like getting to your eyes but if you're using white onion it's not going to be really really powerful like that okay the red onion that I use is really powerful and strong and that's why I have to keep my eyes closed for some time while applying this okay Alright guys, so it's actually not until you're old and when your face is wrinkled and all of that before you can use this. You know, they say prevention is better than cure, you know, so it's better you actually prevent it, okay? So you can use this as a preventive measure onto your skin and it's actually going to help you a whole lot. So after you apply it, then you can give it a little massage, yeah, so that it does get into your skin really well. Now this is something you can, immediately you finish massaging, then you wash it off. You have to wash it off with a toilet soap, with a very mild soap, whichever soap you have, but it has to be a mild soap, okay, so that it doesn't just, you know, dry your face too much. So, after that, then you can go wash it off and then you're good. So that's it guys, it is actually an amazing ingredient that any dermatologist will not tell you. Just take this serious, apply it. One thing about natural ingredients is consistency, okay? When you're consistent, guys, you're going to be amazed by the results because the result is going to be wow the result is definitely gonna wow you okay so that's it guys let me let me just get out your, your, your screen now till tomorrow okay or till evening okay so i'll see you again in my next video go do this and you are definitely gonna be loving your skin i'll see you again guys bye